welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to teach you some techniques and all these different hairstyles you can create using flat irons. So I'm going to be using these today. So it comes with a heat mat as well which is very very handy. I love them because they also look like marble which I'm going to be obsessed with. So when you're taking your hair down you just gently turn the straighteners only by about 20 degrees, turn it slightly more when it gets to the bottom. You can go over it to make it as smooth as you want, but you get this sort of roundness to it that you get if you blow dry your hair straight. Take a section of hair like this, and I'm going to start from about halfway down, and I'm going to take it at a diagonal, so not like this, like this. And I'm going to put it on, twist, pull down. Back to the start, twist the other way, back to the start, twist the other way, and you keep the edge relatively flat. And that gives you a really nice beachy wave. So you can take your hair like that and just wrap it around your fingers. Like that, keep wrapping, wrapping, wrapping. Make sure the end is wrapped up in that as well if it comes loose. And you can take your straighteners and clamp onto them. Can you see there? And get a nice corkscrew curl. So to curl normally, you just take your hair straightener in, rotate it round 180 degrees, get the hair straight in there, and then pull it out. Glide it along, still at 180 degrees. Take it right the way down. And then you get a nice sort of modern wave. Now what you can do is take that from the same angle, so I curled it under. And drag that down. And you get sort of a matching wave point here and here and that's because I've done it at an angle so if you were to do this for a whole head you can take a brush and brush that out and what that does is it turns it into a Hollywood wave so you can see there it all merges together so the next thing I'm going to show you is the plait so depending on your plait size, it's going to depend on the wave. So I'm going to show you quite a small one here. So just plait the hair. So plait it all the way down. Keep your straighteners and just hold it all the way along. Make sure each section heats up. So we need to take it out. A bit like a crimpy sort of beachy effect. Like that. A tiny little corkscrew curl. So you can do this with whatever size hair you want, but the bigger hair, obviously, the bigger the curl. And um, so I'm going to take quite a small bit, and I'm going to take just a makeup brush. Make sure it's nothing that's going to catch on fire. You can use a chopstick or something like that wrap the hair around like that make sure you get all parts of it and when you take that off you get a really tight curl there twist your hair a twist take your hair straighteners and just place it on the twist and again let the hair heat up Cool for a second when you take it out. You get like a real beach wave in that. You can use it like you would use a round brush to 
we get sort of a blow dried look so I'm going to do it with the front section here when you do this rather than when I curled earlier you do it at an angle this one you want to curl back or straight 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 and twist straight and twist that way rather than that way so this one I'll show you an example I'm going to put it backwards and I've got a full video on how you do this so I'll pop the link here because I use this technique quite a lot so I've twisted it round 180 degrees and then I'm just going to pull it through the hair all the way down and then what I do is I twist it up take a hairpin and I pin it and I let that set and I do all my hair like that and then you get that nice blow dried sort of finish at the front of the hair and all over there. So while that's set in I'll show you one final thing you can do is you can get a hair grip and you can bend it like that and again this works on small bits of hair so get a small bit but take the hair in the centre center of the clip like that and then weave it like that over and above in between two prongs clamp the iron on there then when you take it off let it cool a bit and just take the pin out and you'll see you get a really really deep crimp. So I can take this bit out now to show you. Let's take it, take a brush, brush it out so like we did with that the Hollywood Lux look. Brush it a nice blow dry finish to the hair. So now my hair is like a million different textures. I hope that has helped. Um, some of you that have asked me to see sort of close up how I use the straighteners on my hair. And my Instagram, my blog, eliseonline.com and eliseonline are linked up. <laughs>